Vincent, how are you? Scott from Hey You Guys, lovely to meet you. This film is amazing, may I just say that. Uh, how, how much fun was it being part of this process? Because it's a, it's a wonderful kind of love, uh, un unconditional love story between these two kind of lost souls. What was it like playing in this, in this film? I, I loved it. It's, it's, I'm, I'm happy you say that. Because really, it's a, except the, the form of the movie, it's a, it's a love story movie. It's all about love between people, between a father and a son, between a father and a daughter, between two persons who are completely lost. One um, doesn't, th doesn't uh, think anymore about love because she, she, she thinks it's, it's finished because nobody loves her, so she, get, um, she wants to kill everybody. And the other one lost somebody very important for him, so he thinks that he's not gonna find love anymore. And those two persons, one is afraid about uh, life and living, and the other one is afraid about uh, dying. And they're going to meet together, and they're going to build uh, some hope and some uh, and love and and and, uh, and free love because they're not obliged to love each other, which is very very important for me. Yeah. To go to go and, and and meet somebody else and exchange something, which is love, but without being obliged to, which is most important now in the world. How big a challenge is it to play a fireman? Because that's a tough job in itself, but to try and act like you're a fire, did you have to go through a certain amount of training to, to yeah, be convincing on screen? So I went, I went in a fire station during uh, three weeks um, to, to practice, because it's, it's something to, 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 to be uh, very near the fire. And uh, there is a scene, I put fire on myself, and it's, uh, you can't do that in one second. You have to train because it's, it can be dangerous. And uh, to, to change my body, to, it was really a very, very interesting uh, job. Yeah. And, and uh, dance, and um, yeah, I, I, I love that job. And you got to do it's not every day you have so much things to do to, for an actor. Yeah. You got to do a bit of, kind of Fred, your own Fred Astaire moves in this one. How, how, how liberating is it to do dancing on screen? It looks like you had an absolute ball doing all that stuff. You mean, uh, say, say it again slowly. Uh, you looked like you had a, it was very liberating for you to dance on screen, for, yeah. like your own Fred Astaire movie. It was very difficult because uh, you are in front of 80 persons, the crew, all the crew watching you. And uh, so, and, and I hate dancing. I never dance. So uh, I, I had obliged to, I was obliged to, 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 to let, to um, come on, um, not, not be on control. Leave control and, and just try to be um, try to dance as, as I can and it's very for me it's very difficult yeah. because it's it's kind of ridiculous all the time I, I can't dance I mean I mean I don't know what to do Same I prefer to sit down and, and watch the other one Same so but I was obliged to now uh, just finally you've worked with a lot of amazing filmmakers in your career what was it like working for Julia and what sets her apart as a filmmaker right now it's fantastic oh Macarena yeah I forgot that one <laughs> uh, it's very very interesting because she she knows. It. She's really strong. She knows exactly what she wants. She's very intense. And um, she had a very good philosophy, which is um, give me your good ideas, propose things, tell me, everybody. And at, at the end, it's going to be a, a, a movie by Julia Ducourneau. So I, I take everything. If it's good, I take it. If it's not good, I, I don't take it. And so you feel free. And, and, and it's a very, I like to work with directors who listen to actors and actresses and they don't take everything but sometimes uh, it's, it's a kind of a um, respect and uh, sometimes uh, actresses and actors because we're doing the scene we know things we uh, w when we can't do something there is a reason it's 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 uh, if if you are quite okay as an actor if you can't do something that means there is a problem maybe the camera is not at a good place maybe the scene has to be re rewrite, rewritten. It's it's always something, and she's really she hear a lot what what what's going on on the set, and that I I like it a lot. Amazing. Well, congratulations on the film. Thank you so much. Pleasure Thank talking you to you. Much. Thank you so much. You understand, my ladies and gentlemen. You're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed. Yeah. Nice. Hey. hey.